Hey there everyone, in today's video we are going to talk about WooCommerce product retailer. So basically with the help of this plugin you will be able to add a additional field as you can see here purchase from retailer in the option of your uh, product page right. So I'll show you how you can add this particular plugin on your WordPress website. First of all you need to install a WordPress website right and you need to purchase this plugin as you can see I'm on the official website you can uh, buy it from here or you can get it from anywhere else right. So I will just come to my website. This is youtube.samhelanclub.com, which we usually use for our YouTube tutorial. And this is the e-commerce website. So I'll just tell you how you can install and make that particular plugin work for you. Okay. So basically you need to come to your dashboard and I'll tell you what is the basic need of this particular plugin. So if you are affiliated with some kind of retailers, right? And if you want to add their affiliate link so that uh, customer cannot buy if customer don't want to buy directly from your website and if they go and purchase from the retailer then you will get some affiliate commission from those retailer website right if you want to add amazon link of this particular shoe that particular customer will be redirected to amazon this particular product link and you will get the commission right so this is how you can get that particular plugin working Okay, so let's install that particular plugin. I am here on the back end of my WordPress website. Come here at the left hand side of the plugin and let's install add new. And I have already downloaded this plugin to save the time. I'll just come here and upload the plugin. Here I'm sure it's here. Let's upload and install it. Okay, let's activate the plugin here. I will click on activate and I guess the plugin has been successfully activated. And now it's time to add some retailers. As you can see, there is an option to add some retailers. I'm pretty sure it must be in WooCommerce setting or it might be in product setting. Let me check uh, settings. Okay, so under WooCommerce setting, you will see the option. Under the WooCommerce options, you will see retailers. Okay, just click here uh, on the left hand side retailers. And here you will get an option to add some retailers. Let's add one or two resellers. Okay retailers I mean okay so basically I will add Amazon and here it will go amazon.com okay let's publish this <coughs> as you can see this particular retailer has been added or either you can just add your affiliate link instead of this normal link and I will show you how it works if you come here and try to upload a single product. I'll just try to edit a particular product which has been already added on my website. All products and let's wait. I guess it's still loading. Okay, as you can see, these are some products which is already uploaded on my website. I will click here on edit. So as you can see, this product has been opened and let's scroll down and let's see if there is an option for retailer or not. As you can see on the left hand side, there is option for retailer. Click here retailer and you have to search for the retailer which you just added on your website Amazon and I'm sure here is the retailer and you just need to add the retailer and that's it okay so uh, product price you can just add whatever price that is listed on particular website for example if this particular what's the product price it's here uh, the regular price is 4850 we will add here that on Amazon it will cost you around 4000 cool so people can buy from the direct retail website oh, so i will just save this settings update and let's see the product page of this particular product okay if i'm not wrong this has been updated as you can see product updated let's open the product page of this single product click here on the link let's open it new tab as you can see there is a different option just to purchase this particular product from the retailer right so that you can also add the affiliate link of this product from amazon so that you can get extra commission from your website right or even if the customer wants to buy it from your website there is an option to buy from your website i hope you really get my point what i'm trying to understand so that's it for this video i hope you really like this video if you did just give it a big thumbs up and i'll catch you in the next one